Hi guys, you're watching New Frontier of Cleaner Energy. When talking about Hong Kong City, what comes into your mind? The busy harbors, the skyscrapers, or the world's economic center? All of these are inseparable with the energy industry. Recently, the Hong Kong government unveiled the strategy of hydrogen development in Hong Kong, aiming at the upgrading of the energy industry. Today, we invite Mr. Gordon Lam to join us. Mr. Lam is going to share with us the efforts and achievements Sinopec has made and will make in the green transformation of Hong Kong. Good morning, Mr. Lam. Please introduce yourself to our audience. Hi, everyone. I'm Gordon Lam. Uh, I came from Hong Kong and I'm the Chief Supply Chain Officer of Sinopec Hong Kong Limited. First of all, please help us understand the business layout and operations of Sinopec in Hong Kong. Currently, Sinopec Hong Kong owns 54 fuel gas stations in Hong Kong, uh, having successfully established the largest retail network for refined oil and gas products in the region. The company now plays a dominant role in the supply of LPG and also a bunker fuel refilling for ships, direct distribution of diesel and gasoline, and refueling operations at the airports. The launch of the hydrogen development strategy has attracted widespread attention. What do you think is the background and considerations for this, and what opportunities does it bring to the company's future development? Um, and I think, um, you know, uh, apart among uh, uh, different like energies that could be implemented in Hong Kong in order to achieve like carbon zero, uh, like uh, electrical vehicle charging and hydrogen energy, companies like Sinopec, you know, has already been engaged in this industry for many years. And that's why I think it poses a very great potential for Sinopec uh, to bring about uh, the experience and practices of hydrogen energy to Hong Kong and to help the Hong Kong government to achieve uh, carbon zero uh, as soon as possible. But through relentless efforts in continuous communication, government with a uh, lot of like uh, industrial associations and various industries experts, Sinopec has made initial progress in hydrogen energy development in Hong Kong. Moreover, at the end of 2023, Sinopec Hong Kong has held the inauguration ceremony of the building of Hong Kong's first hydrogen refueling station in a place called Yunlang Auto, marking the emergence of a hydrogen refueling hub in Hong Kong that will continuously supply new energy. Besides hydrogen energy, can you introduce more on the company's move on EV charging market? Beyond hydrogen energy, Sinopec Hong Kong is actively developing the EV charging market. So for instance, we have successfully installed nearly 50 charging stations in parking lots of five major properties in Hong Kong. We are also actively working and liaising with the government to allow the installation of charging stations at our existing Sinopec fuel stations. This June, we just received a very exciting news. Sinopec Hong Kong Limited and successfully won the bid for the site of Hong Kong's first dedicated high-speed charging station, which would be setting the benchmark in the charging business industry in Hong Kong. In the future, how will the company further enhance its competitiveness and how will it continue to support the green transformation in Hong Kong? And um, moving forward, uh, on one hand, we will continue to consolidate our market share in traditional refined oil products and securing the energy needs of Hong Kong's maritime, land and air transport sectors, uh, thereby solidifying Sinopec's leading market position. And on the other hand, we will persistently drive the energy transition as well, actively exploring the implementation possibilities of green energy sources such as EV charging and hydrogen energy in Hong Kong so that we can lead the region's green development. Looking ahead, we believe that Hong Kong, with its advantage of backing by the motherland and radiating globally, as well as being an international and big metropolitan city will effectively utilize the green energy industry chain. Thank you, Ms. Lam. 
By your explanation, we now have a clearer understanding of how Sinopec is assisting Hong Kong in its energy transition and green transformation. We look forward to your and your colleagues' efforts to help Hong Kong achieve its established goals. This is New Frontier of Cleaner Energy, and we will see you next time.